Hello everybody, welcome to Little Dungeon Stories. Um, this is a game that is a roguelike RPG with card based uh, gameplay. Um, it is very challenging and uh, it's made by the same developer as the... Uh... Here you go. Um, it's made by the same developer that's done Hymno. Um, and so, and, and some other stuff as well. Um, so, you start a new game. Um, I think this stuff is just like a random roll um, that happens. So, charisma, intelligence, and luck. Um, yeah, so I, I've played once, uh, it was real quick, and uh, you've got health, energy, and humanity, and money, um, and uh, you start off with uh, one of four, one of these um, traits, so plus 20 charisma, plus 12 luck, moolah spirit, plus 20 money, or brave spirit, plus 8 strength and defense. These are a lot better than, uh, than the stuff I had uh, the first game. So let's do plus 8 strength and defense. So we got one card unlocked in this dungeon level. Um, oh, should I have taken that? Whoops. Let it begin. I'm impatient. Let's begin. Torch. Try doing a club if plus 20. We'll just take it. Um, what item would you like to buy in the shop? A uh, potion recipe or a key? Let's buy a key. I didn't find it on the ground. I bought it. Uh, potion shop. Health potion or energy potion. I don't really need either. I don't think I have an inventory. That's what I gathered from playing the first time. So, don't buy anything or humanity potion. I guess I could buy a humanity potion. Um, let's skip it for now. Anvil. You do not have the knowledge to repair your equipment. Okay. Um, blood circle. On the ground there is a stone with a circle shaped hole. Fill the hole with blood. Oh boy. You gotta try that, right? So every time you swipe a card the humanity goes down and it's game over when it reaches zero. Uh, as is... Anyway. You fill the circle with your blood, the stones break, and something appeared. Okay. A bloodstained sword. It is useful for fights against enemies despite being made of glass. It has good resistance. You flip. Okay. So we have good strength now. We can fight enemies. Trap of spikes. Without realizing you step on a pressure plate. Jump with all my strength. Or try to run. Uh run away I guess. You suffer damage to the feet. Okay. Ouch. Ah. Ouch. Oh no. Bleeding. You lose health by swiping a card. 11. That's not good. Black cat sits in front of you. Pet it a little. We can pet a cat. Man. I'm gonna die from uh... Anyway. Prepotent Dorf. Dorf wants to compare your strength with his. My strength is higher. Sure. Impossible. I am the strongest of the dungeon. My charisma went up a little bit. Um, no, you are not. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> Vulcan Axe. It is useful fight against enemies despite being made of glass a very strong weapon. We can break it and gain some spirit. Or we can equip it. 
So our strength has gone up, even though the axe... I don't know what the three is. I'm still bleeding. Sand pot. Keep walking. Where you go with the sword? We'll keep walking. Potion recipe. Let's pick it up. Chest. You see a chest on the ground. Use a key. If not, force the lock. Open the chest and we get sand. It can be mixed with gunpowder to make explosives. We'll pick it up, I guess. Okay. Alchemy table. With enough skills and knowledge, you can create potions. We'll make some potions. Do not have what it takes. <laughs> New lore fairy. I can grant you something positive or negative, but I don't know what I'll be. <laughs> Let's do it. With a positive 4. Charisma. My health is down to 26. 36. Humanity is 40. Okay, God's blessed. The word of God is great. Sell it for a lot of money or equip it. That certainly gave me a lot of... The alchemist asked if you want to transform your potion recipes into potion in exchange for some coins. Yes. Flash of the Giant. This flash was created. Okay. Cauldron. Have a drink. Go away. <laughs> Randomly drinking out of a cauldron seems like a bad idea, but we'll do it. Ooh. Ooh, that was a bad idea. My humanity is, uh... Uh, you find some logs in a way. Light the wood with a torch and rest. Energy potion. Do we have an inventory of sorts? I have no idea. Use stone chest to force it. It's not empty. Shoot. Iron sword. Wait. Why did my strength go down? I have no idea. A distant noise. A dark noise. <clears throat> A dark noise crosses every corner of the dungeon. Where will it come from? It doesn't sound good or so spooky. Fortune teller. The fortune teller asks if you want to play a game in exchange for some coins. Sure. I'm almost dead anyway. Choose a card. Card of diamonds, spades, clubs, or hearts. We'll do spades. Seems like you lost. Want to play again? No. Anvil. I'm almost dead. Heals 10% health and energy. I don't know what picking something up does. Is there an inventory of sorts that I've just not... Let me press some buttons here. Oh, here's the inventory. Okay. Let's... Let me see what this is. Potion sickness. This affects occurs when you drink a potion, it affects your body or your statistics randomly. Oh great. Strange feeling, you start having a stomach ache. I'm dead. <laughs> uh okay. So this was a bit better than my first run. Um, without being intimidated by danger, you enter the crypt. So, how do you restart? That, that was my issue uh, during the... F 
the first, uh, I have no idea how to restart a game. Um, I can't figure it out. I still can't figure it out. Um, if somebody has any idea, please let me know. I've clicked all over the place, and I don't know what happened. And I was just randomly clicking and randomly clicking and randomly clicking, and all of a sudden the game started. But this was the previous game I played. Um, there's... I don't see where you can start a new game. That, that just... That's not a play button, I just moves that out of the way. Um, and I have no idea... And it keeps on doing this, I have no idea why. I'm just swiping random cards and it keeps on doing that. Um, it keeps on telling me I'm unlocking stuff. And all I'm trying to do is... Um, actually... get the game going. But anyway, if somebody else has this game right now and can let me know uh, what is going on, this is version 1.0.2. Uh, the game's not released yet, but um, press copies have been sent out, so that's why I'm playing. Um, but I have no idea what's going on and why I can't... And I, and I tried swiping really far in one direction and I try swiping really far in the other direction um, and I'm getting nothing um, uh, double click the name nope I really have no idea uh, how the and the strange thing is um, <laughs> I almost gave up on recording this video because when you restart the game when you quit the game and start it up again it uh, it's the same, it just loads you right back up to this particular screen. Um, well, anyway, I like this game. It just needs a button here or somewhere that tells you, start a new game, start a new run. How do you start a new run? You know, you, you basically, you can... You can look at your score. Uh, you're being told that you're dead. And that you're part of the dungeon now. And... I can't figure out what to do. <laughs> I'm pushing keys on the keyboard. Um, and I'm getting nothing. I'm pushing stuff on my gamepad. I'm getting nothing. Um, so, I just have... no idea. And it keeps on unlocking stuff, and it drives me nuts. I, I think... I think we'll have to wait until the game gets a new game button, <laughs> new run button or something, before we can make a full assessment on it. As for now, I'm stuck here again. I thought I had figured it out when I randomly clicked something and it just, a new run started and all of a sudden I could play again, but uh, boy was I mistaken. I don't know what this does. I wish I could see that, uh, whatever this says, and I have no idea what it says. Um. Anyway, and I th there was a issue. I, I I think when I picked up the sword, 
my strength went down a dramatic amount. And I have no idea why. Um, I wish... I, I just want to keep on playing, but I have no idea how to. Alright, well, I'm going to end this here. Um, you know, this game is interesting. I, I, I like it for what it is and what it's worth. And I have no idea how much it's going to cost, but... Probably not a ton. Um, regardless, it's going to... You know, obviously it needs some improvements because it needs you, you actually need to be able to start the game to keep on playing. I really, I promise you, if I press this X down here, it just quits the whole program. And uh, if I launch it again, uh, it will come right back to the game over screen. <laughs> I tried that a bunch of times first time, so I don't know what's going on here. Um, if you have any ideas, please let me know. Thank you for watching, and uh, let me know what you think, and give me some thoughts. Thank you. Bye-bye.